part of this evidence song. That's possibly the worst beatbox I've ever heard in my life. From all of us combined. Well, let's be honest with each other. We all know it's the greatest pop song ever written, but we can never compete with that amazing performance of Lady Marmalade. I mean, how hot was that? Very true. because we wanted to give some, some formal advice to some folks tonight. And American Idol Season 7 auditions have started. Actually, they're almost over. Is there anybody in this room that either auditioned or is planning on auditioning for American Idol Season 7? Oh, fantastic. What if you actually? Well, we wanted to offer some, some friendly advice from some people who have been there and done that. I am distracted. You can't just talk to us like that. I'm losing my train of thought. I'm supposed to say certain things here. Oh, we're beautiful too. So, we want to offer some advice, Chris Lyon. Alright, just a little bit of advice. If you, uh, when you try out, you're going to come into a big stadium like this one, and you're gonna, there's going to be uh, tables set up, and uh, make sure you do a lot of drinking before you come. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Alright, when you get in there, you make sure that you have confidence when you get up there, you know, make sure you pick the right song. If your name is not Phil Stacey, you should not be picking Aretha Franklin or Whitney Houston songs. That's a given. That's a given. And uh, make sure that you show some personality. That doesn't mean that you act crazy. If you don't know the difference between personality and crazy again, we'd love for you to try out because uh, Please do. we'd love to see you on TV next yes, year. Alright! Oh, yeah. um, I just want to let you all know from the bottom of my heart that it takes a lot more than an amazing voice. <laughs> Guaranteed to rock your socks off. That's right, we'd like to bring out two of our good friends. Jordan Sparks! 